What's going on people? It's Greg with another Excel VBA tutorial video. Today we'll be going over how to find and replace a value in a list. So let's get right into it. So on the right here, I've got a list of countries and what we're going to do is find and replace um, strings throughout this data. So we'll call this sub find and replace. And we'll declare our variables. We're going to have x and y as range. Um, so what we'll just do is just activate the sheet that we want, sheet one. See it down here. And then we're going to have a count. So worksheet function. Count A, range, we're going to start at A4, starting up here would ruin our count because there's blanks, so we'll start at A4, Excel down and in order to accommodate to compensate for these three cells we'll just add three so if I were to go to the bottom at 231 our count should actually be 231 so let me just do a quick message box and then run the code and you see yeah, the count is 231 at this point so we're good on that so now all we're going to do is we're going to set x equal to range cells let's go with um, column B so we're going to go down five and over two that'll give us this cell and then we're going to end it at count so we're going down the number of entries here number of values 231 and then we're also going to go over two so we're just going to take care of this column here so our range is going to be everything from b5 down to b231 Now, for each for each y in x dot cells, we're going to replace. Let's go ahead and replace all the the s's with dollar signs. And then we'll go to the next Y. And then that should be that should do it. We should be good to go. So let's go ahead and run this. And then pay attention to this column here. And you see now we have all our S's I've turned to dollar signs. So we can also expand this and instead of it just being a column, we can have this cover multiple columns so we'll have an entire range so what we could do quickly is uh, instead of 52 we can start at 51 and then let's do this all the A's capital A's we'll replace those with something so we'll A's we'll replace with fours now you see all the A's here and this column and in this column have been replaced with fours. So let's take that back. So let me go ahead and reverse that. 
and also we'll reverse the S's too. Take the dollar signs away and put S's back there. And just to show you that uh, this is case sensitive, so if I were to put lowercase S's here and try to replace all the S's in column B with dollar signs, it wouldn't work. You see that I'm, I'm, I'm running it, but nothing's happening here because they're capital S's. Now when I turn it back to a capital S, we're good to go. And it also works for strings. So if I were to replace the abbreviation for America with actual America, everything here should change. So let's go ahead and run that. And there you go. So it's a very uh, simple and useful macro for finding and replacing values. And that's all I got. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Have a good one.